COVID-19 has affected the lives of food service employees across the nation, from furloughing staff to excluding the dining experience. For Anthony Vargas, that meant accepting the new normal and picking up another job while working on his transfer degree. Uh, my name is Anthony Vargas. I work as an Amazon driver, uh, as well as a cashier at Rattler's Barbecue. Currently going to COC, I'm planning to transfer to CSUN, study psychology. So the way I got my job was actually through my mom, because she works there as well. It's like a family business. Everyone knows each other. Um, I've actually introduced a few of my friends. It can be stressful at times. With Amazon, it's a little bit different. As a driver, you're kind of by yourself when you're working, and you don't really have those like personal connections with people. But it's more calm and collected. His work environment has evolved to accompany new safety measures and provide their service as efficiently as possible. In his view, it doesn't feel the same. It's made it interesting for sure, uh, especially with now curbside pickup, because now we have to just go outside, help out the customer, come back in. We're just doing a lot of running back and forth. In the restaurant setting, I feel like they don't really take the uh, pandemic as serious. However, with Amazon, it's completely different. It's like a complete 180 because everyone's getting their packages delivered because they don't want to have that contact with people. Uh, they want to just stay as safe as possible and not want to interact with anyone. When I deliver a package, I don't see the customer most of the time. So at, like at Rattlers, they were introducing like meal kits. So they had like a burrito meal kit as well as, uh, it was like a breakfast uh, meal kit as well. So instead of like having to go out to like the grocery store and like buy all these groceries, what they did is they made like a huge market bag with like all these fresh produce items and um, meats and dairy and everything. So they would sell that in bulk compared to like having to go to the grocery store. As the vaccine approaches to hopefully save us from the virus and associated hardships, people are wondering how and if we can return to our normal lives. I don't think we'll go back to our old normal. Like this whole thing is gonna change us forever in the way that we kind of like see others. You know, I feel like a lot of our opinions about everything kind of came out during this time. And I feel like relationships will be forever changed from this. For Canyons News, I'm Edward Rodriguez.